Hey everyone, I'm back at it again. And we're near, not far from Topeka, Kansas. Get something special to do there, but uh, this is uh, my overnight camping spot. Kind of take a look around here. A wooded area. And there we go. On the water again. <laughs> well, I've been lucky now with these places on the water, haven't I? The water's a little high. They've had some rain here for the last few days, pretty heavy, and it was actually going over a road on the way in. I'll uh, have to show you that. But there's a uh, vault toilet over there. Um, there's some geese out here. Let's get Sophie and take her for a walk and go check it out. How's that sound? Okay, operator error. Had an audio failure here, so I'm going to have to narrate this. Uh, I'm at uh, Lyon County State Lake. It's a fishing lake here. It's got all kinds of uh, jetties set up and a dock. And Sophie uh, enjoys the little loop around here to walk. Uh, it's a 14-day area. And uh, pretty pretty secluded and quiet. There's a road, gravel road out there. Uh, it goes uh, across the, I guess it's like an earthen dam at one end there. One end of the lake there. But you can drive on to the right on the other side of the lake too. I just didn't feel like taking my rig through the water. The water was running across the road because it's a little over full. And uh, must have had a pretty good rain and, and the spring runoff and everything caught up with it. But uh, I got some geese out there and a little island out there was kind of cool. Take a walk on this little jetty here, kind of give you an idea and look around. Sophie was loving it. There was all kinds of goose manure around. You had to watch where you're walking. But, uh, yeah, your cell phone signal's pretty good. Verizon and AT&T have got pretty good signal with. I'll leave the GPS coordinates for this site in the description. Uh, they're really, it's, the, there's fire rings, but not real designated cam campsites, like you pull in or something. I'm on a loop that goes behind the, uh, the vault toilet there's a fire ring out there i just kind of parked on the side of the road it says not to drive anywhere that there there isn't a road um it looks like people have driven up to these camp these fire rings and stuff and camp there but i didn't want to do it it's you can see it's pretty wet and uh i didn't want to get stuck i didn't want to tear up the grass and i didn't want to get all muddy either so I mean, when Sophie muddy, so I found a high and dry spot off to the left back up there. You can see the trees and everything. It's just beautiful in here. It's got all the information on fishing and hunting on this board here. If you want to, you can pause it here if you got want to read a little bit more of the information on the length and limits and stuff. But uh, I've had a couple looky loos come through here. You know, you're. you're when you camp in spots like this, the locals are always interested in you and seeing wh where your license plate's from. It's kind of funny. Older people uh, like like to do that, and I usually oblige them and talk to them and tell them where I'm from and from and everything. And but uh, it was pretty windy today when I got over here. I was fighting twenty mile an hour winds with gusts over thirty easily all day long. For well. Not all day long, but for two, three hours of driving. I stopped in uh, uh, Newton, Kansas, and visited uh, the Omega Auto Clinic. 
And I don't know if any of you watch uh, Hoovy's Garage, but uh, that's where the wizard shop is at, uh, where Hoovy takes his vehicles to have worked on. So a few of you may know, a few of you probably will th ask, what am I talking about? But <laughs> just one of my stops, I didn't figure out everyone would join it, so I didn't really film any of it. But uh, you, here, here up here is where I was talking about where the water's running over the road here, and uh, I think you couldn't really tell how deep it was, and you don't ever know if that gets undermined from the water. And I really didn't really feel like trashing my home because uh, that's that's where I have to go home at night. And back up the other loop, back up to uh, our rig here. And see, there's the uh, the uh, vault toilet. It's very clean. It's well stocked. Toilet paper, sanitizer. Um, they keep it up here. I mean, the grader was going grooming the road when I was uh, coming in, so they definitely care and are taking care of things. You know, a nice little park. But uh, if the wind calms down here, we'll go ahead and uh, put the drone up and give you an aerial view of it. And uh, But uh, we'll end the, the Sophie walk portion right here. <laughs> I hope you all enjoy this little tour of this campground and uh, I'll be sure like I've been doing lately put the GPS coordinates in the uh, description so it'll be there if you're interested and remember to like share subscribe smash that notification bell if you have any questions or comments Please leave them and I'll uh, get back to you as soon as I can. Have a great day. I know I will.